Hello. This morning we're going to upgrade this HP Pavilion. It's a TPM Q188 laptop. It has an internal M.2 drive, which is a 128 gigabyte SATA M.2 drive. But the customer has provided a an upgrade, a one terabyte crucial drive that is compatible. It's the M.2 SATA interface. So let's get this out of here and. I'm going to have to take the drive out and put both the new drive and the old drive into my PC because that's the only machine I have that has two M.2 slots that are compatible with M SATA drives. Just going to try to get in between the in that little line there. Trying to pop it up from the middle, up from underneath to pull it inward away from the edges. That seems to work really well. Oof. That's a tight fitting case. <clears throat> so there's the drive. I might pop in Crucial, the new one. Make sure the computer recognizes it before I go any further. So what's on the bottom? There's a lot of memory chips on the bottom. It seems like the old drive has no memory chips on the bottom. It's a flat circuit board. This, there are at least two millimeters maybe more of disk uh, or memory sticking down I'm just gonna turn the computer on to make to make sure that the computer will recognize the drive Okay, so under Legacy Boot, it does the DXD. That's good. Let's turn it off. Okay, I have to stop recording because I'm going to use this PC to do my disk cloning. So the disk cloning went very smoothly. I popped both of these drives into my main PC, replacing my existing M.2 boot drive. So I wasn't able to do this and record at the same time, but I used mini tool partition wizard to copy, basically to clone the old SSD onto the new SSD and resize the partitions in one action. And it went very smoothly and very quickly. That's two M.2 drives, I mean, it was still, still using the SATA lanes, so 6 gigabits per second or 6 gigabytes per second limit, but it went fairly quickly. It only took about 15 minutes probably to clone the drive, which had 128 gigabytes of data on it. Looking for me to log in, it knows so it'll eventually figure out that I'm not. That's brilliant. That's exactly what he wanted. Um, 
don't think there's much more to do here, so I'm just going to shut it down. Let the customer know that it's ready. That was it. Thanks for watching.